Um, okay. Okay, everything is stable. I'm going to pause the video. <laughs> and cross your fingers. You get to see my desktop at times because this game is really, really old. And it does not game capture. It has to monitor capture. But I think it's working. The miracles of modern and ancient technologies colliding. So I'll bet nobody is browsing for this game. Uh, this is Indiana Jones and the Infernal Machine, which is the first 3D game for PC I ever bought. And it just came out, I think yesterday, on GOG.com. So uh, yeah, I, I picked it up immediately. And it works. And I can stream it. So instead of Star Trek Online, wow, I almost said Stargate Online. That's an old game. Um, but instead of Star Trek, I'm going to see how this works. Maybe I only play it once and everybody hates it. But uh, it's a big old nostalgia trip for me. Just want to triple check that the sound is working. I'm going to have to use my laptop actually because triple check Whoop. that the sound is working. It works. So this game, this is the menu and it uses Windows interface to do half the work. Voila. So it's hard to start it off like at the actual beginning because then I have to capture the sound and route it through voice meter and do all this rigmarole to get it to work. I'm not going to do that. So unfortunately, this is going to be this is going to have to be the beginning of the game. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. This game is horrible, but it's so nostalgic. Time to go to work. Heck yeah. Time to go to work. Oh, I need to tweet. This game doesn't use a mouse. It's keyboard only. They call it tank controls. And I would tend to agree with that surmise. I need to tweet real quick. It's Indiana Jones time! Is anybody using Infernal Machine as a hashtag? I'm gonna. It's Indiana Jones time. I don't know how long I'll play. It might be two hours. It might be three hours. I only got like three or four hours sleep last night so i've been chugging coffee all day i'm wired i'm excited i may crash at any moment so let's do this the game actually crashes when you customize the uh controls but oh no I was going to say, but you can edit the uh, keyboard control file manually in Notepad. And um, I forgot to open Notepad on my other screen. So I'm going to have to like refer to this every now and then. But I, I think I've got the gist of it. 
and it crashes if you try to change it, so I'm not going to do that. Oh, this is so good. It's in 1080p. Last time I played this, we had square glass monitors. Well, that's not true. I played it on Nintendo 64 a little while ago. But. Yeah, here we go. The good old tutorial mission. I believe um I don't know how what the sound the sound is really quite spotty as far as like volume goes so if people want it turned up let me know but I think I'm going to keep it at this because see, when you, there's a lot of really quiet sounds and really loud sounds, and they'll play together very often, so. Oh! Okay. There are secrets everywhere. And the thing about the secrets is you can get the money. And then once, at the end of the levels, you can buy stuff at, like sort of a shop thing and restock and if you get a whole lot of money you can unlock a treasure map and it's a bonus level I'm situating my, my feet here I have to remember my custom controls there's crouch Apparently this is all in a day's work for Indy, getting to the job site. I played a little bit, just to make sure that the game worked. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything down there. Hmm, that thing looks whippable. Whippable. That thing looks whippable. Whip it. <laughs> this is so great. Unfortunately, because this is full screen locked, and I can't alt tab or everything dies, I'll have to. Remember to use my laptop. If anything comes up, I'll have to make sure my laptop doesn't fall asleep. Put that whip away. And there's something up here, see? I noticed that earlier. I remember enough to be dangerous, but I don't remember all the secrets. I remember the snake in there. Nope, not the whip. The weapons have some funky sort of auto-aim. And it's not auto-aiming yet because his gun's pointed up, but he'll point at things if you've, if you've done it the right way. There we go. Come on. There we go. Yeah. Hey. Hey! It's a crystal. No rupees in the bush. And saving is manual. So if you forget to, forget to save and you have to reload, you're out of luck. So I'll name my saves creatively 001. Oh, I thought that snake was alive again. So 
So I've played this game many a time. And I know there's another game, Indiana Jones and the Emperor's Tomb. I've never played that one. Whoops. So maybe, just maybe, that gets put on the list. Oh. Whoa. Am I? Okay, I'm streaming. This is the part that made me turn down the audio a whole lot, because this is very loud. And then it's suddenly very quiet. Get on the ladder. Hello? Oh. Ooh. Oh, that's the skeleton we found, exactly. Look what I found. A gold bar. And look at the top. The subtitles aren't down at the bottom in this game. They're up at the top. Is there anything over here? No? I don't think there's a quick save button either. You gotta do it the hard way. I think we got everything there is to get, except that room over there. I don't think we can get up there. Can we get up here? We can. Really don't know if it's worth it. Oh, whoa! Whoa! Can we? No, we can't. Climb up that wall. I'm going to run over here again real quick, just to be absolutely sure I can't climb up inside this building somehow. It calls to me. Um. Whoa. Don't bounce off the wall. Okay, he can't. Sometimes you'll... You won't know something is there unless you hold out your whip. And he'll, like, look up when there's something to whip. Of course, that's too close. Oh! Oh, whoops. Oh, no! Okay. Oh. Oh, that's the, that's the skeleton room again. Okay. I'm being extra thorough, and <laughs> hopefully I don't maintain this level of scrutiny. Oh. Okay. We're good to continue. Oh. I think... I really do think this is everything now. Cool. Isn't this how you go to work every day? Oh, oh, two. I want this idol. Thank you. 
priceless artifact. There's a secret in here. It's pretty obvious. And this is about as far as I got in my testing. So from here on out, it's the real, real reactions. So there is a dude down there. I don't want to hurt myself. I don't think we can go backwards. Okay, nope, that crouched. That draws a gun. Can I, can I drop down? Stop. So he won't walk off the edge, but you hit shift. But that also makes him run, so don't like vault off the edge of a map. Gold. Treasure. Uh, there is a ladder over here. I'm not sure where it leads. Stupid glasses. How do I drop off? Okay. The... The controls will get you if you're not careful. Like, you'll... He likes to bounce off walls if you were, if your aim is off just a little teeny tiny bit. I'm not sure I know where this goes. Oh! No! Careful. Hello. Somehow my chat seems to not be working quite. This came out on GOG.com like yesterday. So they made it work on modern OSs. Like, I don't even remember them announcing that they were doing this at all. Just all of a sudden, yesterday, it's like, oh, yeah, by the way, Infertile Machine, we got that. I think it's, uh, $5? Totally worth it. Oh, no! Well, I gotta do that all over again. I didn't, ah, oh man, I didn't even see if there was treasure up there or not. This is why. Save often. Yeah, if there's like, well, I was going to say, if there's a definition of good old game, it's this. But uh, I wouldn't exactly call it good, but it's definitely old and nostalgic, and it's great. And slow, in parts. <laughs> uh, okay, line it up. Careful. I'm going to bounce off. Nope. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, back when this came out, uh, we didn't have a PlayStation for Tomb Raider, but there was this. So maybe Tomb Raider was on PC back then, but I didn't know it. So we played a... We had a demo CD. It was just one half of one level, and we played that to death. Wow, so I, I did this twice, and there I didn't even get graced with a treasure. No treasure? Oh, that is unfortunate. Let's, uh... <clears throat> Nothing happened. Everything is fine. Get that gold in the bottom of the pit and we'll move on. Oh no! Oh. Hmm. Hmm. These gold coins. All right, moving on. We need to go check on this dig site. Cutscene. Funny how I didn't spot this before. If this is the prize, I'll lose my grant for sure. Where are the priceless artifacts? The gilded idols? The crowns, the crowns of kings? kings. That level, that ship level you're talking about, I remember that Good, being the one that. Advanced. Better get up there. Sorry, got interrupted by him. Um, I got lost and stuck on that level for so long. But. Uh, um, I lost my train of thought because I thought I saw a snake over here. But yeah, I got I got stuck on that that the, you're talking about the one in the tropics. Put the god away so uh -huh. you can pick up the diamond. With the torpedoes and the mines and the and the sharks and the it was so good. That stupid ice monster. Now what? Oh man, I don't even remember how to do that monster. I remember the giant snake and what to do for the giant snake. <laughs> Spoilers for anybody who hasn't played this game before. There's a giant snake. There's an ice monster. There's also an infernal machine. I'm trying to I don't hear a snake hissing. Is that the way I have to go? Yes. I'm going to save because that would be bad. Okay. Wait. Yes. I'm already getting lost. This does not bode well for the future. What I do actually hate... All good games have a boat level. The water rapids... Ugh. What's that? 
Okay, that's a ledge. But there's also some gold down there. Oh. Interesting. I think there's a snake down here. Nope. My mistake. Look what I found. Oops. Wait a second. There's like a crawly hole down here. Oh! That might be where the snake is. Hello? Mr. Golden Idol? What have we here? An idol. An idol? Okay, and then there was a ledge. Where was that ledge? Oh, it was back that way. Well, I'm going to get crazy, run off the edge and die. Wait a second. It wasn't letting me go left for a minute. Oh. I have some... I know there's a snake around here. You pull yourself up the ledge and then there's suddenly snake. Yeah! Ooh. No! <laughs> okay. Grab the ladder, please. Thanks. There he is. I told you there is a snake. I don't think I can get him from here. And there is no aim down sights. Die, 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 die. Okay. Whoops! Misfire! Everything's okay. I think I got all the idols. I can't remember any other secrets. I mean, they're not really secrets. They're kind of out in the open, but it's kind of training you. Hey. Pick it up. Thanks. It's kind of training you that there are secret areas. I forget how to climb down the ladder, if I'm honest. Oh, figured it out. Just back into it. Well, I'm, my mouse isn't showing up on stream, is it? I don't think so. Ooh. I'm going to save. That's a big enough jump. Oh, oh, four. Don't want to like flub this one and then that's the end of it. Odd. We did it. The first mission. Woo. What now? Sophia Hapgood. Hello, Indy. Been a while. I'll say. What brings you out west? Some psychic premonition about the treasures I should have found? My, look at these wonderful pot shirts. It's the new thinking in archaeology. Find some worthless debris, analyze it, understand prehistory. Kind of noble, don't you think? There's <laughs> an iron curtain coming down on Europe, Indy. The Russians are taking over. I read oh, it was 1947 we earlier for... Noble? We need your help. Uh-huh. Who's we? When I joined during the war, it was the OSS. 
Now President Truman calls us the Central Intelligence Agency. Is that what you're up to these days? Soviet sabotage? Atomic secrets? Don't be silly. We've got whole battalions for that. It's my job to worry about more, uh, unusual activity. Such as this dig site on the Euphrates River, south of Baghdad. Babylon. Remember your Bible? That's where mortals raised the Tower of Babel to invade heaven. Well, you know, this does look like the ruins of a Temenanki, the ziggurat often identified with the tower. Very good, Dr. Jones. You're looking at the brainchild of one Gennady Volodnikov of the Leningrad Physics Institute. He thinks there's some truth to the biblical legend. Isn't he a godless communist? He's a physicist who studied manifolds in hyperspace. Quirky theoretical stuff. Well, what's a guy like that doing in Babylon? Hyperspace. Not sure. All we really know is he thinks the atom bomb is a joke. Then why isn't the world laughing? Indeed. Suppose the tower housed some deadly force no one else had ever heard of. Something as dangerous as nuclear fission. And the Babylonians tore it down for reasons not discussed in the good book. Exactly. It's an amusing theory, but as you can see, I've got troubles of my own. You don't think I flew out here from Washington just to relieve your boredom, I hope. This came from the Russian dig site. Uh, somebody made a mistake. This looks like part of a steam engine, maybe a locomotive from the last century. There's no mistake. We've dated the thing. It's 2,600 years old. Really? Look at that little wheel spin. How'd you find it? Come on, Indy, we're the CIA. We have spies. We have spies. Dun, dun, dun. Didn't take much convincing, did it? Ta-da! Um... I don't remember how to read this. There is a manual in the book that explains the screen, and I remember IQ stands for Indy Quotient. <laughs> but I don't remember if like 100 is the best, or... Oh, I don't know. And I don't remember if that's all the treasure. Now look, see right there, there's the secret map. You can stock up your money, and then once you buy the secret map, it immediately takes you to the bonus level. Um, I think I'm good. You can pick up these things in the map sometimes, but... Okay. Your inventory and account will remain unchanged. Do you want to abandon the purchase? Yes. Babylon. Babylon. A lot of mud brick and not much else. Why do the Russians want to dig it up? Why do they indeed? Save it? Oh. Another nice thing is it saves every time you start a new level. So it's kind of a checkpoint. And then you can go back and replay anything you want. Um... I forget where to go exactly. You know, there's a Russian camp just over that hill. Oh, ta-da! Like I said, Russians. I should. Oh, this is the challenge with this sort of game. <laughs> It's not the puzzles. It's not the combat, necessarily. It's the jumping on the pillar that you know you need to climb on and then falling off the other side because you didn't jump early enough. There's something up there. I see that. Oh, no, it's not. It's super quiet. I may turn it up. Maybe. I'll I'll trust my testing earlier. 
and it was plenty loud. I'll just turn up the sound. Um, where does this box need to go? There we go. The challenge at times is also figuring out how to actually move the puzzles around. Like so. There's, there's no secrets. remember how to sidestep. I think I wanted it, I think I tried to set it to A and D, but it's not working. I'll have to fix that later. I don't slash hope I don't need it. No secrets yet. Hurr, jump! The Minister Stra hereby reminds Comrade Dr. Valodnikov that socialist theory disavows the existence of supernatural powers. Those doctrinaire apparachiki. What is it? They think I'm out here searching for God? Possibly. I'm just decoding the message, sir. I am searching for Marduk, a creature the Babylonians worshipped as a god, but he doesn't live in heaven, just on another plane. What kind of plane, sir? Soviet or American? <laughs> what airplane, you idiot? It's, it's another, another dimension. Reality. The Ethereum. Be careful, Professor. When questions of ideology arise, they often conceal doubts about methods and results. In four ministers, we're making excellent progress, all according to plan. We know the true story is waiting in the room of the tablets. That's where we'll find out what happened to the tower and to the machine Marduk inspired. We are close. It's a matter of days. And damn the ideology. Hmm. Language. My coffee's all gone. Sad times. Is he still in there? They're all gone. I don't think I can get inside. But now we can go this way. It's, it's tempting. I think I could make the jump though. <laughs> You're going to learn the sound of that swipe means I'm about to save before doing something stupid. And jump. Oh. Quite an operation the Russians have going here. Makes me jealous. Sight is crawling with guards. I better steer clear. <laughs> steer clear? Or go in gun blazing? I do seem to have memories of ages past going in guns blazing. It is totally possible. I believe those are explosive barrels also, but let's do it the right way. <laughs> oh no, Indy doesn't like snakes and I don't like spiders. And there's a big old stupid web.
I'm not sure what the plan is here. I figured it out. Is there any treasure down there? I don't remember. Oh. I don't know if jumping across is going to serve any purpose. Her jump! I think maybe we're supposed to drop. Yoink! Please don't be a spider. There's a spider. Luckily they can't climb up. Come on. Come on. Gotcha, you little varmint. <gasps> Another one. Oh no, I put my gun away. it are there spiders over there jump I like how the defense against spiders is a gun um I I recall the whip works on spiders. Does it like flip them off and then <laughs> flip them off? Flips them off their web and then you can shoot them. But I'm not sure. I know you can use the lighter to light webs. Oh, hello. Drop down. Is there any treasure that I missed down in this water? Oh. All right, I'm gonna save and then jump in and then if there isn't anything there, I'll reload. Because I couldn't quite tell if the texture meant there was a hole down here. There's not. Load. Yes. Badoop. I believe they call this save scumming, and I do it without remorse. Oh! Ouch. I was here. I was. I was worried about spiders dropping on my head. I didn't know there was a rush in there. Okay, now he's sidestepping. Oh. Oh. Where are you? There you are. got you oh yeah you can kind of like aim a little if you can manage it yeah shameless oh come on and that would be how you uh go in guns blazing <laughs> pick up the poison please some medicine. Some medicine. A gun. <laughs> A gun. To be honest, that is a fairly good gun, so... Make sure you... Oh! And I just use the ammo. Put the gun away. I don't know if you could check on ammo. 29. 
So the good old Indy revolver has infinite ammo. Give me that first aid. What's this? I need it. Like first aid. Right now. Alright. All clear. Girl again. I'm doing the... You can tell when I'm getting into a game because I'll go back to the old... Like, can I look around the... No, I can't. It is not a VR game. <gasps> if This would be like... The perfect game to redo in VR. It's not even that graphically intense anymore. I would play Infernal Machine VR. Oh, man. Now I'm like, maybe I could get away with making a demo level. Probably not. Oh. A first aid kit. A medical kit. A medical kit. Is there anything in here? No. Here it's a bucket. I'm like paranoid about the spiders now. Feel like if there's any place they would drop down on my head, it's inside of a tent. Is there anything? There is a gun down there. Did I shoot a guy and he landed in there? That doesn't seem right. Um, walk down, please. Quietly. It is very quiet, actually. Whoops! That was what me. Have we here some medicine. I may want to change it to control. I'm like, I customized the controls for what I thought I would like to use, and it turns out that I'm using control to interact with stuff instead of F. Control is draw, and F is use. I may use F to draw and control to use. Why did I come down here? Climb up, please. Thank you. Nope. Oh, I'm gonna f walk off the edge. This is the right way to go. For the most part, I do still feel like I know where the secrets are, and I, I'm trusting my instincts to make me go, don't leave until you get everything. And I believe there isn't anything yet. So, we're, we're good to go. Oh, I see a guy moving around. Nope. I did that. I pushed F again to draw. Control to draw. Control to draw. Oh. Whoa! Excuse me, sir! It's a friendly neighborhood American archaeologist. I don't know where he is. Where are you? Are you... Oh, there you are. He's like right underneath this awning. Can we... I don't know what... 
the plan is here. Probably just run off the edge. It's the flippy noise. It's time to save. Hurt. Hey, He's shooting me. Come on. Dirty fighting. Put the gun away. Oh, there's a lot of first aid. I'm going to use the med kit because I'm hurt. A, a trauma kit. What's this? Is a full heal. First aid. And these little dudes are little heals. First aid. That was some in-depth commentary. Oh, that's a scorpion. They're poisonous. Not as creepy as the spiders, now but what? probably more dangerous. What was that I picked up? I just picked it up on autopilot. It was a trauma kit, right? Yep. Yes, it was. Now, a lot of reviews are like, oh, the level design was great. And I guess for the most part, yes, the levels are memorable. But it's like there's they there's a lever here to open a fence gate they like installed a lever in the side of these the side room ah. stuff like that all the time where it's kind of like when you really think about it doesn't quite make sense but i think there's a secret back here of course there's not I do need to push it, though. Push! Push, Andy! Seriously. Grab it and push. I'm not gonna lie. Most of this game is fighting with the controls. Oops. That was a sloped wall. Can't jump there. Oh, cutscene. All right. Dun 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 dun. They've installed giant metal doors. That's my passport. Excellent observation, Indy. Let's crouch and I guess it doesn't matter. Is there any treasure? Oh. I thought I saw someone walking in that room. You know what time it is. Oh, we had some artifacting up there. There's like some weird stuff going on with the textures up there. There's a room and I'm going to, ouch. There is fall damage evidently. Ah, I knew it. Whoops. Look what I found. Man, I would change the controls right now, but it would crash if I did. Someone don't let me forget to do that. Change my shoot controls. What's what's over here? Um 
Is this the hard mode? All right. Saving again. You're supposed to jump on top of the truck. Can we do it? Yeah. No. We cannot do it. This is awkward. Get up there. And Can I climb up? Oh, there is a ladder. Look, smiles on us today. Luck smiles down from glitchy clouds. I'm saving it again, in case you couldn't figure it out. All right. Hurt. What? This is going to be a pain. I can already feel it. Deep down inside, that gut-wrenching feeling that this is going to be one of the hardest parts in the game. I guess we practice jumping. You don't want to run and jump. I'll just fly over the truck. A walk jump? Or maybe I just run off the edge. That's what I did last time, right? And jump. Yes. La la la. Yay, I'm talking over the music just in case it gets flagged. Oh my gosh. Don't jump off. There's a there's a guy. Don't jump off the top of a truck. Aha. Uh -huh. Some medicine. What have we here? Some medicine. Some first aid. Uh, okay. Yeah. We're going to use the trauma kit because we're making mistakes. We're getting messy. Oh, I jumped off the from up there, didn't I? That's what hurt. Oh, yeek. again. Ooh. That's the noise he made. Woo. Get out of here. Collect the ammo. Forget the treasure. I'm gonna collect bullets for this. This is actually a stronger pistol than Indy's, so maybe I should be using it. There's no crouch. I'm do I did the thing again? <laughs> like There's no one here. Oh, Yowch, he shot me. Who is that? Ah, there you are. Whoopsies. Oh, he's up above and shooting at me. Oh, I know why it's so hard. It defaulted me to senior mode. I did p see that earlier. There is difficulty settings. 
See, senior. I'm not playing on easy. I'm playing slightly above medium. I mean, look, there's freshman, sophomore, junior, senior, graduate, and Dr. Jones. And I just left it on default. Map rotation. Oh, there is M for map. I forgot. Oh, wow. We're talking Doom sort of map. And we're talking old school Doom. Is he on top of the truck? Oh, there he is. I see you up there. I would like that first aid. Oh, this is going to kill me if he shoots that barrel. Please look in a direction that's useful. I Now what? Some medicine. Hmm. Some medicine. I don't know if it's worth <laughs> No, it's not worth shutting off the stream to change that key. We're all just going to have to live with it. Please don't shoot me. I do want to run out here and get this. Aha. Uh -huh. I did it. First aid. I don't know how he didn't see me. A box that we have to, okay. Oh, nope, he let go. Are we aligned? No, we are not. Where do we need to put this box? I, I think it was in the right spot, actually. Yeah. Although, does that look whippable? No, <laughs> it's not. Okay. Control puts it away. All right, we're gonna have to be quick on the draw. And it would, I would have failed. There we go. Three, two, one, draw. And draw. Quick draw. Oh, sight. Draw. Yep. Okay. I'm going to save it. Can I look around while hanging on the wall? Yes, but it's not useful. I know you're up here. Oh, there's a jam. What's this? Well, Indy, it's an emerald. Now the question is, did he go to the, to the left or right? The left is clear. The right is clear too. Where'd he go? Oh, he could have been standing down here and I wouldn't have even seen him. I'm starting to think maybe that's a jumping puzzle pack. I think that slope straight ahead is too steep to climb, so I think we're okay. Ah, I found you. Can we sidestep? No. Hey, Tim. And flubbed it. Who heard that? Nobody heard that. We've got our first machine gun.
inch to the left. Inch, inch, inch. Boop. Little side steppy, steppy step. Okay. A gun. A gun. Yes, Indy. Thank you. He doesn't even say what kind of gun it is. Just a gun. All right, that definitely is whippable. And it looks like if I fall, I could miss the pit, but still like hurt myself. I think I need to go down there. Oh yeah, definitely, because there's nothing on the other side. F. Woohoo! No treasure. Turn around. Be very, very quiet. Literally a bottomless pit. There could be Russians up here. Don't draw the whip. Oh, the whip. Up. Oh. Get. Get. Oh, there he is. Yeah. We line of sighted that dude. Of course, now everybody else has heard the shots. What's, oh. It's a skeleton. Can I climb up here? <laughs> skeleton, poor guy. Wait a second. How are there, how is there a set of skeletons just in the drain pipes? Quiet again. Whip around. I don't think there's anybody in here. Then again with the drain. There is a sewer system. I don't know if we're supposed to remember that these are air pockets or not. It's kind of one of those things I'm remembering. You ever kind of like, when you rely on instinctive memory, you're kind of like, I kind of remember to maybe try to remember about air pockets in the sewer. I think there might be a guy in there. No, let's not shoot the barrel. A suspicious dead end. I mean, okay, there is literally nothing here. Is there a truck that's supposed to pull in? Can I climb in here? Can I line it up and climb inside? It seems indie sized, right? You guys can see this too, right? Is there someone in here? There is a lever. They've installed another lever in these priceless ruins. That looks like a suspicious climbing path. 
But there's nothing on the other side. Yep, there's nothing there. Ooh, it's yawning time because I got four hours sleep. Is that a book? Can we loot the book? It is a Russian book. All right. Lever pulling time. Pull. Oh, push. People walk out, right? Oh, Comrade Doctor Valadnikov, we have Narushitin in our sight. Capture him if possible. Otherwise, Strelia the dog. Da, sir. Da. Oh, there are them. These guys. Those are that blank expressions of we mean business. Control draws. Okay. I want to do the sidestep thing, but it's not letting me again. I don't know what the criteria is. Of course, put the gun away. Boop. Boop. Point the gun, Indy. Point the gun. Guy cartwheeled it out of the way. Oh, Indy can do that. I should do that more often. The roll key. Look, we're gonna just run out. We did it. It's a running gun. We probably used more bullets than I would care to admit. The lights came on. Is there anything of interest now that the lights are on? Oh, the lights are gone. The lights are glitchy. Where did they come out? They came from this way, right? Okay, this is where I picked up those... I heard something. This is where I picked up the, uh... The poison. Poison packs. Whoops, not this way. Oop, not that way. This way. There's a secret behind this box. I can feel it. Also, mostly because it's a dead end if otherwise. Yep. It's probably spiders. Spiders like to, like, drop down on your head. They'll sit up by the door. The map makers were mean. Okay, so this, this is the sewer. Time to save. Because I'm pretty sure this, we haven't found any treasure yet. Okay, if there's like a second level, even? Thankfully, Indy can hold his breath like... I was gonna say a walrus. That's the first word that came to my mind. He can hold his breath like a walrus. What I meant was dolphin. All 
Ah. There's a secret path of some sort. Yeah. I knew it. I won't, like, be a perfectionist, a treasure perfectionist. I just want to get enough money for the secret map, because that's, like, half the fun of this game, is the special level. In this Nintendo 64 version, I believe you only unlocked that map when you collected literally every treasure on every map. And that's a bit excessive. I mean, good on them, <laughs> I guess. That's like in the days before achievements where you'd unlock maps. You'd know if anybody would seen a map that they'd 100%ed the game. Okay, this is a breathing hole. My phone's lit up. I don't know what the deal is with these underwater, oh, treasure. It's treasure. That's what the deal is with the underwater map. Or maze. What's down here? Okay, nothing. Man. Where's the exit? Is it here? No. No, Indy. Don't do that. Is it there? No. I'm trying to rack my brain. Is it here? I don't think so. I think there's like a an underwater, like a lower level path that's kind of off the beaten path. It's not that one. It's not that one. It may be this one. No, it's not. I don't think there's a button to hit anywhere to like open up the grades. And this is a treasure hole. I'm lost. Somebody help. We're gonna die down here. This seemed lower. No, I, it might, might just be my imagination. Well, no, it's the right way. Be prepared for Russian. Control to draw, F to fire. Control to draw. No treasure. Of course, he decides to sidestep. Oh. There is a key to this door with TNT. Oh. Hey, остановись. Здравствуйте, товарищ. Open the door. I'm here to deliver supplies. You know, dig stuff. <laughs> Whatever you need, I've got it. Ты шпион? Мне прекрасно стрелять. I don't know what he's saying. Bleh. What? Hello, Dr. Jones. Welcome to Babel. Welcome Simon. to Babel. Remember, 
CIA, Sophia works for me. Oh, you stole the cogwheel. <laughs> and our combi friends don't even know it's gone. Vladnikov's a hopeless academic, not a field man, and frankly, I need clues he doesn't have. That's why you got tapped. You are a famous archaeologist. I'm just a spy. This should get you through the door. By the way, rumor has it they found a gold statuette of the winged god Marduk. Be awful nice to have that. CIA runs a museum. The company runs a hive of soulless bureaucrats, but I am a passionate collector. But I am a passionate collector. I'll bet you are. Yeah. I don't even remember. <sighs> when did. Whoa. You're distracting me. Chat, how dare you? Whoop. Watch for the legs, because we can't look up. Well, we can, but it'll put us back. Oh, F, shoot. Um. Yeah. Where does this go? Oh, nice gun. It's weird because I have Twitch open on both screens because I was going to read the one and then type on the other, but all the chat is like not where it usually is. It's on my laptop. So I keep glancing over and seeing an empty chat. Okay. He gave us a key. I don't want to go in the door yet. I'm running around. Okay, yes, I do want to go in the door. No, I don't. I wanted to heal. And then save. And then open the door. There's a keyhole here. I just need the key. Thanks, Indy. Put the key in the keyhole. We're just gonna stock up some TNT in this room. No real reason, along with an explosive barrel. It is Soviet efficiency. You know what? It's not wasted bullet. See, this is one thing that's different from the guns. It's farther distance. How close do we have to get? Pretty close. All right. Good enough. We are smashing ruins. Indiana Jones. Ruining ruins the world over. That's a long drop. I'm gonna save again. Just because it's a good habit to be in. Uh, oh, splash. There's a gold bar. I like the treasure that's out in the open. So we are going for that. Uh, what is it? The tablets? What do you call it? Oh. oh. What happened there was I jumped at the wall at an angle. You will just rebound off of them like a pinball. Okay. Clearly, we need to go that way. There is nothing special in this room. And jump! Maybe there's a spider. No spider. Is there anything up there? There might be. Can we jump up here? No. Or can we? No. I see the grabby ledge, but... Oh. 
Okay, definitely spiders in there. I know it. You can't fool me. I think I can light these. Yep. I did it. I can't remember if it pulls off some Zelda tricks or not if you do that, but I did it. Man, I know there's spiders in here. There is only one thing to do. <laughs> Save, and then run in and run out. Run in, run out. Not dropping from the ceiling. Unless they're way up there. <laughs> Double check, triple check. Is that a. There is like a hole up there. Wonder if that's anything. Oh. Attentive players will realize that this is a different colored square on the ground. I guess Mr. Otis didn't actually invent the elevator after all. Turner was right about the logic. A good digger would have found this long ago. A good digger. The good digger. I don't think I can pull this out. Can I push it? Is the question. Indeed. He's in, I can't tell if he's like lining up. Oh. I can't push this any further. Well, that answered that question. Done, done, done. Well, there's some parts. What a contraption. How does it work? Well, let's put the part in and see what happens. What you know? Sophia's little gift has a purpose. Da 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 da. And then there's tablets. Hmm. This might be important. No kidding. Looks like a door to me. Why doesn't it open? Okay, well, he is just full of enlightened answers. So, what do we need to do here exactly? I hear something walking around. It's giving me the creepily feeling. Can I push this now, or will he just be like, "Arg"? I'm out of room here. You're not out of room. Come on. Oh, voila! It worked that time. But I don't wanna. I know it's a spider spot. What gun do I have? All right, that works. Draw. Sidestep B. Sidesteppy? No, don't walk in yet. Okay, where am I? Nebuchadnezzar's library, maybe. Shh, don't disturb the patrons. Well, 
That's easy. They've been dead for thousands of years. Ha ha ha, Andy, you're so funny. Oh! There's a scorpion. That's what I'm hearing walking around. There's a button. I want to push it. Before we leave. Hey, push the button, Andy. Push it! <laughs> um... Button push. Okay. Enough of that. It doesn't want me to push the button. Fine, I won't push it. I didn't want to push the button anyway. Time to save. Well, I forgot to take my hourly break. All right, you scorpions. Ha! Oh, there you are, you little... Oh, there's two of them. Yeah, yeah. This way. How does a spider take three shots? I'm like, quietly, I'm listening for spiders. I know this, spoilers, this door opens. I can't remember if spiders or snakes come out. <laughs> Something comes out. Who's here? Nobody. Ah, a gem. Hmm. Well, I'll take a ruby. Ruby for my troubles. Okay, that's where I came in. I think. That's where I have to go, clearly. There's a cuneiform tablet in there. Hmm. Hmm, oh, there's a ladder. And we're climbing. Well, there's a block. What's... Don't know what this cubby hole's all about. Can we drop down? And then can we push? Nope. I'm out of room here. And if I pull, it won't let me pull. No. Yikes! It might be that that little cubby hole thing is here. Because you can't sidestep off the ladder. This is back before games were smart enough to let you climb onto a ladder sideways. I know there's a spider around here. Okay. Oh! Treasure. Like, is that a skull or is that a treasure? A 
That's it? Do I need to push it? Okay. There's no room to maneuver. Oh, I just remembered a new Tomb Raider came out, didn't it? I need to put that on my list to play next also. All right. There's a gem. I believe we can climb on top of the block and then get that gem and then drop down onto that button. Or there's a whip thing up there. The path is clear to me. Oop. Okay. Before we start making leaps of faith. Line it up, jump! See, I'm going to load because, because <laughs> I know I can make that jump. Yeah, what? Seriously? I will save scum because why waste time climbing back up? Uh. Oh, there's the whip. The whip thing. Yeah. Oh, it's a tablet piece. Oh, I almost jumped down. There's gonna be spiders up here for sure. Okay. There's definitely a cuneiform piece. I want that ruby. And I will have that ruby. What's this? Part of a cuneiform tablet. Cuneiform tablet. Save for posterity. Whoops, 006. Yeah. And it's gonna break behind me. Because they're a different color object than the rest of the map. Oops, a daisies. Ah. Uh. Here we go with the thingy. And like we learned with the Russian truck, just a little jump. Ta-da! Hey. Hey! Yeah, and if you jump on that, then it opens the door for all the snacks. Boing! Dun, dun, dun. Snakes or spiders? Or scorpions? Take in bets now. What is that a trap? Of. I bet a ruby on snakes. Eek. Climb quick. Oh, there's a web down there. I may have lost myself a ruby. <laughs> the music is like dun 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 dun.
<laughs> Saving again. Let's see. I think you just don't touch the middle. Whew, that was close. Uh -huh. There's a lag for jumping and another text fragment. Another text fragment. Gee, I wonder what kind of trap this is. Is there even a trap here? Roll perception. I don't think there's any point in shooting. Wait, unless it's a secret. If that thing's coming out, maybe it's a secret. Oh dear, it looks like a secret. It is a secret. Darn it. I don't want to go in there. I'm going in. Oh. How pleasantly surprising. Oh, it's that statue of Marduk. Marduk? Well, well. Look at this. Marduk. Wings and all. <laughs> Not bad as priceless treasures go. Marduk. <laughs> Foreshadowing. Oh, and now I think the other side has opened up, so I'm climbing up here just to make sure. No, it's still closed. Easy, so now we go put the pieces in the cuny form. Make sure there's no spiders that have respawned behind us. Nope, we're good. We're good. Um There's some cuneiform writing here, but I can't read it. Some of the tablets are missing. Some of the tablets are missing? Oh my! There, it fits. But I still can't read anything. Wow. You miss one block in the middle and you can't read it. Now it starts to make sense. Let's see here. Make welcome seeker. Know that it was Nebuchadnezzar in heed of the writing uh, that Marduk made appear unto him who builded the great engine. Having no understanding, the rabble had thrown down his work, but four trusted disciples are, are scattered upon the face of the earth, and the relics go with them. Wouldst thou tread the path of knowledge, look eastward. Ergon it is who flees to the heavenly mountains, where Shambhala holds a mighty secret. Ah, oh, the sneaky glimpse heavenly behind the door. That means the Tian Shan Range. Dun dun dun! Well, Indy, according to the red dot, we need to go from the blue dot. Or maybe we're in the red dot and we need to go to the blue dot. Is that the Dead Sea? No. This thing looks, I don't know what this looks like. I know we're in, whatever. Oh, okay, we're clear. Yoink. Now what? What's this? An idol. An idol. I think we can push this button now? No. Oh, we push this crate off into the new doorway.
Grab it again. And push. One more time. Grab it. And push it. And I do believe... This is the end of the level, but I'm going to make sure we can push it now, right? Boop it. Yay! I can't control anything. He's just totally enamored by this brick wall. I just want to make sure there's nothing else. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's you. Ah, Jones, there you are. Got a statue for me? Will this do? <whistles> it just might. Anything else? I'm going to you. shove this the into my pants. Great engine. When the Babylonians smashed the thing, four priests escaped with the parts. Taking them where? Not sure, except in one case. Some fellow named Ergon headed for the Heavenly Mountains. There's a crude map of Central Asia. That's not much help. Might be enough. The Tian Shan Range straddles the border between China and Kazakhstan. The name translates as Heavenly Mountains. Kazakhstan? Last time I looked, that was Soviet territory. Maybe I won't show the border guards my passport. Okay, buddy, it's your funeral. <laughs> it's your funeral. Ooh, la la la. End of level flourish. Dramatically watching as Indy drives off into the distance. The Indy quotient is only 30. 10 treasures is a nice round number. I'm going to assume I got everything. Rifle rounds 10, 9mm round 65. Three first aid kits. Seven poison kits. Halfway to the cost of the secret map. I'm kind of tempted to buy a trauma kit. But I don't think I need to. Abandon purchase. The Tian Shan River. Oh, it's snowing. I'm pretty sure you have to shoot wolfies in this map. Here it introduces the healing sprigs. Look what I found. Medicinal herbs. <laughs> Medicinal herbs. What have we here? Um, we just started. No need to save. Famous last words. Hello. Is there something up there? Oh, there's that wolf. I told you. I told you. Oh. I don't know if that's... There's like weird cubby holes, but I don't think... Those actually lead anywhere. Uh, he's going to attack me. I'm going to shoot only in self-defense. Shoot! Oh. Okay, you don't kill them, but you do shoot to scare them off. Oh, gosh. He did claw me, the jerk. That was a leap noise. Hey. Hey, silver coins.
I think a Russian truck drives across. Yep. Can we climb up here? No. Leap onto the bridge. Perfect. Okay, the truck came from this way. <laughs> Clearly we cannot go this way due to the odd slope. They pull no punches about what's the end of the map. I thought I saw like something in the wall, but there's nothing. And I, I don't know if the AI is smart enough to know what a gunshot noise is. We're kind of used to that idea now, but... Oh! Get out of here. As I was saying, we're kind of used to games nowadays being smart enough for that, but... Maybe not. Get out of here. It is a Russian checkpoint. Miss that super loud water again. Jeez. I may have to turn it down for the water it level. Whoa. And it looks well guarded. It looks well guarded. I can single handedly. Whoa! Get out of here! Get out. Go. All right. I'm crouching. I know there's a guy up there. I see him. Everyone sees him. It's broad daylight. Everyone sees him. I'm going to save. 007. Dun, 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 dun. Yep. I... Wrong music. I did that on purpose, I swear. Oh, he's he saw me. Easy, easy, easy. Oi! Whoa. Gotcha. Come on. Yeah. Well guarded. Three guys. Um, we can climb on top of the tower inside. So. Easy. And so begins the very loud river. Me that I oh hey hi it's uh it's all clear it's all clear this way I think this opens the gate voila it's a door but I can't seem to open it from this side oh yeah I believe we can climb in from... Now I'm gonna be honest, I'm not sure where to climb in. There is an... There is a water... See, there's a... An opening... To the river. Down below, but we can't jump down there, because we'll die. I 
Thank you for your contribution. Okay. The truck drove off into the distance. So we have to jump up onto the guard tower. I don't remember having to do that. Oh, no, 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 no. Keep pushing the wrong button. Please don't tell me he ran up this. Oh gosh, that kind of scared me. Okay, can we, in fact, jump up onto this guard tower? Yep. Oh, it's the machine pistol. A gun. He is so enthusiastic. Whoop. Sneaking inside. Oh, I could turn down the sound inside the game. I can. Beep, boop, push the button, open the door. Okay. That's a yes. I don't think there's anyone in here. I mean, in, oh. Famous last words. Can I aim through the door? No. Four is the machine pistol. Whoops. Beep. Hey, hey. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas? It won't budge. Oh. I will take your first aid. He puked his first aid. First aid. Oh, and we have an additional sprig. The big leaf. You'll get like... Oh, fine. It won't budge. I showed you not budging. I know there's a way inside. Oh, there. Nope, that's a great. Ah, see? There we go. The trick. Can we jump? Oh, I did it! Look at this gigantic air vent. Locker? Oh. Now what? A raft. So this is how the Russians patrol the river. Well, Indy, I would assume that they did use a boat, yes. What have we here? A raft repair kit. A raft repair kit. I wonder what that's for. What's this? A medical kit. Oh. I don't know what that button is. Oh, that opens the gate. I'm gonna push it. Get it over with. That's the way out. But I want this treasure room. 
I jump. I fell out of the ceiling, right? Yep. So I'm gonna have to do the jump thing again. Think I can do it a second time? One shot. One shot. Nah. I did it. I'm climbing into the wall, but I did it. I don't think there's anyone in there. Nope. A whole big box of coins, though. We have completed the tower. And this is the part that I absolutely hate. Oh, gosh. The controls are reversed. Sort of. The animations throw you off. So what happens if you'll hit hit these rocks. I'm gonna be saving constantly because this is just not a fun experience. And then there's that one point that the the the, uh, the current splits and you're like swinging around down a corner and you'll just kind of float around the wide angle and you need to turn more narrow. What is that? Oh, gameplay options. You need to hang a tight turn at some point and you always miss it. And if you do miss it, you have to do it all over again because it's like, oh, somehow we're gonna go back upstream and repeat this thing. I'm gonna save. I don't like this. You don't punch holes in your boat hitting the wide walls, but that sharp one, you'll poke holes. That's what the repair kit is for. Okay, okay. Hmm. So I guess it doesn't throw you right into the river segment. How do I get out? F. Fold it up. I'm sure there's a wolf. See that the water was quite loud. I'll just have to talk louder. Oh. Let's not use the machine pistol though. We just got I'm just your friendly neighborhood indie. Now what? Gold, I mean silver. Looks like a shrine of some sort, actually. Oh. Whoops. It looks like a candle holder. 
There's some old Persian writing here. I think it says, pray to the four winds. Pray to the four winds. By the way, if anybody has seen my old art, you might recognize that building in the background as a reference for a building that I drew long time ago. I think the river, the river fun starts over this way. We have to find the four candles. Ska. I would like the rifle, please. Blah. Yeah. I don't know what they're saying exactly. Is that a radio tower? Yes. Yes, it is. Make sure nobody's sneaking up on me. All clear. Maybe. Oh. Slowly back away. I think there are raft repair kits in here again. <laughs> uh oh, I'm gonna sneeze. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'll say there's raft repair. Look what I found. Raft repair kit. Look what I found. We here a raft repair kit. I don't think I really need this. Excuse me, you need all of that. Hmm. A medical kit. A medical kit. Okay. The river. Um, I don't remember this. You know what they say about that feeling you get on the edge of a cliff. The whisper in the back of your mind to jump. Oh, wow. We didn't see what was down there, but, uh... Like the game over screen. Load. You can't see my mouse. Guess that's good. Okay. Clearly that is not the way. And here starts the river. The river rafting level. I hate it. This is the worst part. It's confusing. All you do is hit rocks. When Indy says, I don't really think I need that. He is lying through his teeth. I saved already, right? Yeah, because I jumped in. Duh. Because you need to collect four candles. Swing around. Oh, see? All you have to do is nick it. Save it.
there's a place. You're supposed to follow the bells. And one of the bells is really difficult to get. Oh, don't you pop my raft! Okay, we're going to the blue one. Okay, okay. I mean, we've got some current. It's pulling us through. I'm gonna save it again. <laughs> Cause really, I, I don't wanna... Blue path. I am not gonna keep doing this as often as I did. On other playthroughs. Okay, okay. Mm. Now see, here's like that spot, one of these convergence points. If you go the wrong way, you'll always end up, well, here. This will be a tree. Oh, always reminds me of a tree. A tree that you will grow to know and love. Is it a tree? It is a tree. It's the red one, right? A beeswax candle. A beeswax candle. As opposed to any kind of other wax. Look what I found. Is there other kinds of wax? It's not really something I've ever thought about deeply. All right, get the uh, get the raft back out. I'm gonna save it again because I'm a pansy. Red candle, red candle, get. Um, it was actually really crazy to get OBS working with this. Um, let's see, what did I do? I had to use the NVIDIA control panel to uh, keep the aspect ratio scaled properly because it wanted, the game wanted to stretch full screen crazy. And OBS, I had to capture the monitor rather than the game. The game capture wouldn't work. I had to use the, what is that? Monitor capture or whatever that was. I can't alt tab either. If you alt tab, it just goes nuts. <laughs> Otherwise I would look to see exactly what I did to set it up. delicately trying to control this. Uh, I'm turn. This is why I hate this part. No amount of turning can get keep you facing the right way. Stop it. Stop it. Thank you. Please just dock. Get out of here. How do I get F? Yeah, so um, let's see. The, the quirks I've noticed, you can't alt tab or 
if you do, you can alt tab from this screen, but if it's like, if it's got a Windows dialog box popped up, and if you alt tab then, it will die. Um, you cannot change the controls. If I try to edit the key bindings, it'll just crash. <laughs> um, let's see. It wanted to stretch, so my monitor is 1920 by 1200, and I told it to be 1920 by 1080, and it still just stretched. So I don't know how ATI cards, or wow, that's a that's a throwback. I don't know how AMD cards handle that, but I had to use the NVIDIA control panel, some funky stuff in there to... There's like a desktop scaling settings screen there and usually it's just like let let the monitor scale the game and then you can tell the video card to scale the game and then that'll fix that problem but it's a it's a challenge for sure and if you want to change the key bindings you have to edit the files in notepad <laughs> <laughs> Big old water mug. Wow, I'm like watching myself drink this now that I'm pausing. It's like, oh, this is a good morning. And it's definitely better than trying to get it to run. I actually have the original game CD, and I tried to get that running a long time ago, and it wouldn't work. So I'm glad GOG, GOG got on that business. And it works surprisingly well for <laughs> what it's worth. I mean, 1080p. I think this is broken, to be honest. Oh! Click. I think this will go back up to the... <gasps> I almost jumped into the water, and that's instant death. Okay, so there's two paths on the way in here. I have to go up, don't I? Whoosh! Okay, so I've done the blue path. And what it did was lead me to the red candle. So we get to do it all over again. And then if we really have to, we can run back to get more rafts. Okay. This is where we hit not gonna hit it this time of course I'm gonna turn around and hit that one instead yep 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 all right so we went the blue path I'm gonna save it red candle get bonk paddle come on Put some shoulder into it. Eek. Ah. The challenge is to stay facing the right. Okay. Oh, well, we're going the blue path, I guess. 
I guess I don't know where we're going because I'm turned around. Stop. Indy paddle. Get out. Gosh. Blue candle? Or is this green? Get! Aha. Uh -huh. Another candle. Just need to calm down. Getting more frustrated than I. Oh my gosh! I have developed a spider phobia since I played this game last. It was a long time ago. Um, and they still scared me back then. I almost ran off the edge of the pier again. Whew. Green candle. Green red. Heck yeah. A pure nostalgia trip this thing is. And I don't know how many of you watching know that this was put on GOG.com uh, yesterday. Yep. It's on GOG. Just brand new yesterday. And I'm like, I'm... Does it have an F5 quick save? I'm afraid to push it, to be honest. <gasps> quick save? F6 is a quick load or F8? Oh my gosh! You're, you just, like, I wish I would have known that, like, when I started. <laughs> nope. Don't tell me nope. I don't want to get the raft out if you're going to break a difficult. Is there a secret behind this? I feel like maybe there is. There is not. So if you haven't noticed, there is a little bit of a trick to the boat where if you do have a hole, you can pull it out of the water and reef open it. Indeed, just put the raft in the water. You can fold up the raft and get like a whole new air bar, but it's still got a hole. Uh, we're gonna... This... Okay. There is a split in the path here. See, there's a, there's a path that way. Oh, gosh. The fourth level. I mean, I have a lot of... I wouldn't call them good memories. But I have a lot of memories. Both good and bad, I suppose. This one, this map... Is the infuriating one. I hate it. I still hate it. It took me forever. What have we here? And then I was, I remember being stuck, like, 
nothing else um, in the tropical islands with the sunken ship. Then the lava monster. And the ice monster. <laughs> the snake one wasn't too bad. I think my favorite is actually this one, Shambhala, the Shambhala Sanctuary. But the lead up to it is so astronomically painful. This room, like I have bad memories of this room because Indy just doesn't jump well. And it's a jumping puzzle. You jump off, you try to get on those platforms here, you'll fall off, you'll slide underneath and get squished. I believe. What is that up there? You see that up there? Straight ahead? Is that a golden idol? Is that literally just a nothing room? It's just an alcove. Okay. Thought maybe it was something useful. It's not. I'm going to abuse quick save, that's for sure. Second, I feel like there's a secret over there. It's calling to me. <gasps> See? I'm not gonna put up with it. <laughs> Jump! Oh man! At least loading is super fast. Back in my day, it took nigh on 10 minutes to load a quick save. Whoa. Is there nothing up here? Oh my gosh. Oh, I. Oh my gosh. <sighs> I don't want to restart the chapter. No, oh no, there's a cutscene. <laughs> Archway to nothing. Rip. Rip in peace. Dun 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 dun! It's sad though because the loading screen has the Indiana Jones music. I mean, I guess it's good for the stream, <laughs> so I don't get like copyright flagged. But it's nice, I like hearing the indie theme flying in, and the computers these days are like, loading done. And hoop. Nemesis. The rest of the game, easy. It's this. It's this water river level. Ugh! Nailed it! I swear there's like treasure hidden in these barrels. Oh no! There it is. I see it. Oh, it's a health kit. It's not even treasure.
jump! Oh no. Definitely a spider alcove. Please no have spider. Oh, okay. I forgot there was one in here. Now what? Purple candle. Another candle. Okay, so I forget what path we took to get here. We went to the red one and then we went right. So the hard one is going to the red one and then left. Because the current wants to take you right. This could be the record finish. Should I be starting a death counter? I should, I'll rewatch my own video and like put a death counter in the description. Oh no! Ah oh, man! I saved it before I did all the cool stuff. Do it! Jump! Did it again! Please no. Okay. Jump! Oh, injure you! That's gonna be a tone that everyone's gonna know and love by the end of this. Did I hurt myself? I don't care. Saving it. Saving it again. Jump! Saving it again. Let's not jump in the water. Saving it again. Give me that candle. Hey, another candle. Another candle. A breeze wax candle. Give me that. Aha. Boink. Idol. I want that kit. Thanks. What's this? A medical kit. Oh, there's a thingy over there. See that? I don't know if I can get to it now. The current's going to just take me immediately down there. Hmm. If I jump down, that's going to hurt. Oh, what? Oh. There for a second, I thought I missed being able to do this, and then I was mad at myself. And then I was like, oh, it won't let me. And then I was relieved. And then I thought about it again, and I'm like, why can't I climb this side right here? Why can't I do that? Now I'm mad at the game. Yeah, and I don't even remember what is in that room. Oh, okay, I'll have to. We're gonna find out what's in that room. If I can remember, okay. I'm, I'm starting to get a bit frantic. Just need to stay focused. Yeah, I remember it being super hard to get into that room 
also. And I think maybe we can s squeeze in here. Yeah. Nope. See? Screwed it up. Nope. Somehow managed to nail it. For a sapphire? Or is that a ruby? I mean, oh, a diamond. It's either a diamond or a sapphire. Save? We're going for it. And hopefully, it's just one more river trip. <gasps> Spiky rock. Pull up to this rock. Whew. Do I have three or four? Wait a second. Oh, it's reset. Do we have three candles? Green, violet, yellow. One more time. Do some stretches. Get your fingers ready. We do have a couple of raft patch kits. So we're not totally out of luck if we manage to get ourselves really stuck. Or hit a rock. Like that. <sighs> Good luck getting it to work. It's a it's a beast. Please. All right, we want the blue path. Please. Oh, 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 oh. The blue path, please. Okay. Stop. Indy, please. Please, Indy. Please. Please. music it's like I got here for the first time no there's spiders up there trust me I remember you don't need the launcher if you don't want to install the launcher which is another nice thing about GOG you can just download the game files and install it. Please go left. Yes. I'm saving it. For better or worse. Probably worse. Oh. Dang it. It was worse. See what I mean about 
Okay, so I did something wrong. The game itself will run right out of the box. But if you start doing things like alt tabbing or setting up video recording or trying to get the sound to route through voice meter or something, you'll it'll start getting really crazy. Someone playing loud music outside. Okay. I have one more. I want to quick save up here. Man, I usually only want to play for three hours, but I'm like, I really want to play just a whole lot more. Please do not hit that rock. You're backwards again. You hit the rock. We're gonna go this blue path again, but I don't think there was a split in the blue half. I will shamelessly reload. I'm gonna hit that. Ooh, that was a close one. And yeah, this is just a, a one shot all the way down. Oh yeah, that's the place I need to go, somehow. Yep, and I got that candle, okay. Whoa. Graphics anomaly. Please, no, don't hit the... Cutting it close, Indy. Wow, something flipped me. Okay. <gasps> stop. Please stop. Sweet, yes, 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 this is the right spot. If you ever need a walk through, this is how you do it. Oh, that was the follow noise. Oh, nuts. Thanks for the follow. <laughs> T-Man of C-Town. This will be the last candle. Then we can get out of this river. I almost fell in. I'm done looking for treasure. I'm done looking for secrets. Just let me in. Is that a candle in there? Uh, Jay, let me see. Mm, yes. I do believe, Indy, that it is a candle. In my mind, 
Oh. Pull the... Destroying private property. Da 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 da. Climb out. Don't fall. Yeet. Yoink. What have we here? Ooh, okay. It's stressing me out. I'm getting quiet because I am stressed out. I hate this level so much. But that's all the that's all four candles. It's done. All we do is go back to that the four winds altar. Easy. It's a uh, smooth sailing from here. I was wanting to play the new Tomb Raider, but I really haven't justified spending all the money on it yet. But this is perfect. I'll play Indiana Jones, sure. And then I also have Emperor's Tomb, which is sort of the spiritual successor to this. I haven't played that at all, so if I played that, that would be like a, what do they call that? All I can think of is cold turkey, but that's when you quit. <laughs> blind, a blind playthrough. From what I know, it's similar to this. I don't know how charming it is. This game has its own sort of horrible charm. <laughs> 007 is the save we're working out of. Hey, doggy. No, no. Keep hitting the wrong, the wrong button. There's no healing kit in here is here. is the year it's been three hours my words are literally failing me put the candles on the altar It fits. It's a miracle. It fits. There. I hope there's no order for these. <laughs> Imagine Indy just smacking down a candle. Success. Oh, we have to light these dudes, too. Light it. Oh, the other thing about this game is the controls are absolutely atrocious. No mouse. It's arrow keys 
and then QWERTY. QWERTY. Yes. Shambhala Sanctuary. Strange place for a moment. Ha ha ha, Indy. Oh, the candles mysteriously blew out in the middle of a snowy... We didn't get all the treasure. I'm pretty sure there's 10 treasure per level. I am not going back to do that treasure. Okay, we have three trauma kits. Sweet. Three first aid. Lots of poison kit. Sprigs and herbs. A sprig is a, like a first aid kit, and an herb is like a trauma kit. Um, lots of ammo. Still saving for that map. Shambhala Sanctuary! Oh. This is a game that I really wish they had a soundtrack album you could buy. But, oh, that was a spider. You jerk. Ah! It's hunting me. Um, there's no paranoid of spiders now. All it takes is one dropping down on your head for you to be, well. I admit I don't have a rational response to spiders. Ooh. Oh. Oh, I see. That's the rope for the elevator. Which is broken. Honestly, I should call the stream here before I get started on this, but... Just a little bit more, please. Is there a Yeti? Oh. This seems like a monastery, oh, but the religion wolfie. is unknown, at least to me. Back off. Don't you think about it, bucko. Get out of here. Look, do yourself a favor, run out the gate, and then I'll close the door. Hey, hey! Is there something sneaky up here? Oh, there is. Oh, I bet this is the way in for real. I'm pretty sure that's certain death. Unless it's a secret. No, to be honest, I think it's death. For some reason, this door won't open. 
because there's a wolf at the door. Get out of here. Okay. I just wanted to make sure I couldn't go into that front door. I couldn't remember. It's the wall climbing. Oop. Please look up, Indy. Thank you. Whoa, that sky is doing... Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Is there an idol? You know what this calls for. Oh, hey! <laughs> what look at there! Grab a hold. Grab a hold! <laughs> and still in games these days, you still have these dumb, precarious ladders that just... Tomb Raider's full of them. It's like... This hey. game... I don't even know how old this game is when it first came out. And adventure games still do the same things. It's always parkour. Of some level. Um... There's a broken window. But I think we just go straight up, if we can. I doubt that we can. <laughs> the textures are so blurry. Oh, this is a complete and total dead end. Nineteen ninety nine. So twenty nineteen will be twenty years. Man. To be perfectly honest, I am, like, floored that these old games still work on modern computers. I mean, even the original game CD that I have kinda works. Wait a second. Okay, no. But I always approve GOG making it legal to buy old games again, man. Any spiders? We're on top of a temple now. Whoa! Whoa. Well. <laughs> Excuse me. That was as shocking for me as it was him. I was looking for the opening to go find the lever to open that. There isn't, there isn't one. Jump. This is the top of the clock tower. I think. Okay, so we do need to go down. Oh no. Hmm. That didn't quite work. Tell you what. Oh, that that button's pushed in.
<gasps> Who? Thought maybe that was a pit. Don't be spiders. Thank you. I'll pull all these levers and see what they do. And then I'll go get good. My words. I can't talk when it, after it's this doing something wrong. long. <laughs> how, how I form sentence. Oops. What happened here? Ooh. Did the monks lose faith all of a sudden? They didn't even bury their dead. They did. Beep. Of course that didn't work. <laughs> Wait a second. I thought this was the door. Hmm. Okay, that's a ladder on the way up. So none of the levers work. And... Oh. Oh, yes. I remember this. <laughs> now, what in the name of biology was that? Now, what in the name of... Brew Ice Monster? Big old clock tower. Okay. And I should quit. Sprockets in the inside of Dad's old clock. Huh. I want to get the clock working, though. It's a big old clock tower. I forget exactly what's involved when you face this dude. The ice guy. There's only so far he can run. He's in here. There he is. That little roly poly. Grinning. Abominable. I forget how to get down. It looks like I just jump across. Yeah, I missed. Oh, okay. We've made a huge mistake. Well, um, well. <laughs> So my my health bar isn't going down, is it? I think I was just getting ice blasted. Da 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 da. The clock. I don't think there's any. The monks probably ran their whole operation with water power. Thanks, camera, for like ripping control away from me. Water power. The elevator's busted. Okay. We can do this. I think. Um... Oh, whip! We haven't seen one of these in a while. Hoi-cha! Who? 
I think this is the top, tippy top. Oh, no. Yes. Yes. Is there a warp up there? No. Giga! Ah! Dead. <sighs> I bumped my head on the whipping post. Let's try this. Let's try jumping from here. Wow. Is there treasure up there? Or better be treasure up there. Wait a second. What was that? I saw that skeleton. <gasps> there is a medicinal sprig. Yeah! Wow, I got greedy. Skip that. Mine. Now what? Medicinal herbs. <laughs> Medicinal herbs. Jump! What? He bounced off. Good night. I should quit, really. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I probably should quit saying I quit. Nobody wants to hear that. I'm gonna get back to the clock tower part. Nailed it. <gasps> Almost missed that one. Please climb. Don't make this any more difficult than it needs to be. Almost did it again. Is there anything special? There's some. There's a shelf. There's a cubby hole. <gasps> <Whew. laughs> Andy, you're risking life and limb for what? For witches? Sweet. I'll take it. To be honest, the game's pretty well paced. There's not like a lull. The only lulls really are between chapters. I don't... I'm trying to remember if there's ice people up here. Tick tock. Well, that wouldn't have helped, Indy. Tick tock. Tick tock. That's the door to the outside, right? <gasps> Whoa. Ah, I'll bet there's an idol down here. What have we here? Secrets. Keep it secret. Keep it safe. Okay. That's enough 
That's all for me. I'm done. 008. So... It's actually moving along pretty quickly. I forget how many areas there actually are. I don't know if I'll keep playing this or play, go back to Star Trek Online, but... Games with a beginning and an end, I find, are easier to stream and find things to talk about. Because I know there's an end in sight. Instead of playing an MMO. Although Star Trek Online is pretty fun, and I will keep playing that. Is it the big hand that's the hour hand? Or are they both the same size? Okay. Anyway, I will probably stream again Thursday unless I really wreck my schedule. Which is possible. Trying to think of anything else to say. I really can't think of anything else to say. So I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. It was fun. I know this game is like super old and a lot of people really don't like it, but it's fun. I think it's fun. As long as you don't put a whole lot of thought into it. <laughs> And maybe I, I don't know. It's like, I really should find some sort of a theme for my stream as a whole. And I don't think I want it to be like, you know, play Warcraft all the time. Or even play Star Trek all the time, even though it is fun. It would be fun to play the old games. Like really obscure old games. I would do want to play Halo. That's not nearly, <laughs> that's not old or obscure, but I like Halo. Perfect Dark, I want to play that. Now I'm just rambling because I'm tired. Okay, I'm done. I'll see you Thursday. Same time, same place, same channel. Same game, probably. I'll finish this game. I know I was hopping around between, I, what is it, finished Chrono Trigger and then went to Warcraft and then I'm like, oh no, I don't want Warcraft, I wanna play Star Trek. And then now it's like, oh, I don't wanna play Star Trek, I wanna play this. I'll try to finish this. I will finish this. And then go back to Star Trek Online probably until I find something else. But yeah, see you guys later. Thanks for watching. I I'm really logging off this time. Uh, you'll get to see my fancy pants desktop. Oh, nope, you won't. Because there's a ghost image from... I don't even know what that is. Is that, is that VLC? Nope, it's just broken desktop. <laughs> oh, good old games. Not GOG. GOG's great, but, you know, the old games. How did we survive? I mean, these quirks happened back then, too. It's just, it was par for the course, and we knew how to deal with it. Edit the INI files and all that stuff. Anyway, <laughs> I'm logging off now. See ya.